Hey everyone, the Joyful Yogini here. So I did my live weekly reading as Madame Euphrosini today at 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and I normally do it at the same time as Facebook, but my computer was totally dead. It would not charge on time, so I wasn't able to do it. And now I am so hot from having that wig on for all that time that I decided to do it as myself. So here is your weekly reading. And there's three cards that I pulled. So the first one is Remember Who You Are, Archangel Michael. Remember who you are. So you are powerful, loving, and creative child of God. You are very loved. So this week, is if there's any time this week where you forget that and you're feeling maybe alone or down on yourself and not trusting in who you are and the magnificence of who you are. Call upon Archangel Michael to help you to remember who you are. Because if you are, whether you believe in God or not, it doesn't matter. So don't, you can delete those words if that doesn't feel good for you. But I believe you are a divine being. We're all connected to the same energy, the same energy that creates worlds. So you're pretty magnificent. So I am here and our angel Michael is here to remind you of that. The next card for this week is brilliant idea. So yes, the idea that either you've just had or that's coming in this week is a divinely guided message. Go forth with it, run with that idea. And it says, yes, your idea is divinely guided. Please take action and bring your idea to fruition. So if you have this idea pop in and you just feel the excitement and energy around it, move forward, people. It is a good thing. And the next card is peace. Archangel Chamuel. Peace. Uh, peace comes from remembering that only love is real. And I love it how he's holding the dove because the dove is a symbol of love. So now when you have other emotions such as anger, frustration, maybe jealousy, fear, guilt, shame, all that feels pretty damn real, right? But um, Archangel Chamuel wants to remind you that those emotions are coming up as your way of your body talking to you. Because when you feel that discomfort, there's something you need to shift. Maybe you have to shift your mind, your, your thought process about a situation or a person. Maybe you need to change your course of action. Maybe you need to actually take some action. Maybe you need to set some boundaries. So those emotions, they're, they're real within your body, but they're not necessarily real as in this ha it doesn't have to be your reality. So when you think about divine love, if you believe in angels and guides and things like that, which I do, and if you don't, it's totally cool. But if you believe in that, it's, that's what love is, unconditional love. And that's who you are. And that's what you deserve to receive as well. So, but when you're not in that loving place of, life is awesome, I'm in so much gratitude. It simply means that something needs to shift, okay? So just take notice of when you're not in that space and then process that and see, okay, what can I do differently? Is there, what can I do to help bring me more peace and love into my day, into your week? So I hope you have a super awesome, fabulous week. This is the Joyful Yogini. And uh, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Well, only if you're inspired, right? If you like the videos, then subscribe. I already posted two other videos up there today. And I hope you have a super awesome rest of your week. See you later, everyone. Namaste.